In today's video, we're searching for the missing Yu-Gi-Oh! What's up guys, we're back with another epic opening. In this video, we're gonna be trying to pull not just one missing Yu-Gi-Oh card, but two different missing Yu-Gi-Oh cards. What does that mean? You're gonna have to wait and find out till after the giveaway. I'll be giving away these three DUSA effect failures. All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know down below which missing Yu-Gi-Oh card you wanna see pulled. Now let's explain what that means. So if you guys have been a long time or somewhat long time watcher of the channel, you know that I have a goal of pulling every single ghost rare ever made. And obviously we have not done that to this point. Here's my progress so far. I'm actually gonna try and figure out what we're actually at. We've actually made a pretty decent dent recently pulling some cards I'd never pulled before. And today I would like to add at least one more card to that. So what we will be doing is opening some Clash of Rebellion special editions because we've never pulled this uh, Red Eyes Flare Metal Dragon on camera. Also, we have an Extreme Victory boost box i have never pulled the junk berserker i think it's called is the ghost rare in this set it's this card it's not like the greatest card ever but i've never pulled it so it has to be pulled at some point and shout out to ex gamer this was some of the stuff he sent me in his mystery boxes that we didn't open because the videos would have been entirely too long because obviously there's more that he like i haven't opened yet and this is still like an entire video worth so that's why i separated it into a different video but shout out to him again ex gamer is a legend let's get into this stuff and hopefully pull a missing Yu-Gi-Oh card for our goal of pulling every ghost rare ever made. I'm gonna do you guys a favor. I'm gonna crack open these special editions. I also have one pack from when we did another Clash of Rebellions opening. I'm gonna add that there. It should be 16 of those and then a booster box. All right, I got all the Clash of Rebellions packs out so we don't have to like, you know, go through all that packaging because we do have an entire booster box of Extreme Victory, which is also first edition, by the way. So pretty cool box and tour guides, obviously, in here, it's a crazy card. So we're gonna open this thing up. We have 40 packs exactly today. So this should be a decently long opening. If you guys are uh, excited for somewhat of a longer video, let me know down below. All right, Extreme Victory, good stuff. I mean, this is a 5Ds booster box. I think it was the last one. So it is not as crazy as some of the other 5Ds boxes, but it is still a very old set. 2011, I think, is when it came out. So let's get started. I didn't even take the promos out of here, so we'll go through there. We'll see some promos. Let's see if we can get a missing Yu-Gi-Oh card today. Here we go. EX Gamer, send us some luck. I'm gonna do three until we figure out the pack trick for sure. We have Ceiling Ceremony, Force Red. I didn't mix the packs. Probably should have done that. I'll do that after this pack. Esper Girl, let's just pull the ghost real quick. Mech Time, we have Necro Defender and Contract. Okay, we didn't, uh, nothing crazy happened there. All right, I shoveled those up just for a little bit of fun. Here's the extra Clash of Rebellion pack that I had. Let's see if we can get a Ghost Rare out of here. We want that Red Eyes Flare Metal. That's what we're going for, because that is a card we have never pulled before, and that's the goal of today's video. Obviously, I want to get something good for EX Gamer, no matter what it is, because these are his uh, boxes. He sent me Ignite Paladin. We have the Kamungius Siggy String Kaiju and the Ignite Crusader. That is a super rare right off the bat. That was the third pack in a special edition, so not bad. Very solid start. We have a super. I've had some crazy luck opening boxes recently because I'm getting a little bit ahead for, I'm going to be gone for a weekend and stuff, so I'm a little bit ahead. So I've recorded a few videos farther into the future than I normally would. Uh, so I don't know exactly the order of when they're coming out, but there's some pretty good openings coming up. There's an ultra rare, so it looks like it is the third to last card. Mara of the Nordic Alphar, ultra rare, very cool. We wanna get that uh, tour guide, we wanna get that junk berserker ghost rare. Two foils so far is not bad. But yeah, I'm hoping we can uh, have a little bit more luck, continue our goal. I think one day, honestly, I think we can do it. I think we can pull every ghost rare. I would not be surprised if we did it. Uh, just based on, you know, when you when i have a goal and it's very in line with the content you know open opening packs it's not like i'm doing anything crazy out of line to like open packs because that's what we do anyway i feel like we can do it at some point we're gonna need some luck obviously it's gonna take a lot of time but assuming that this channel is still making videos in the future then i think that we can do it and i hope we do it'd be really cool and i think it'll be really amazing when we do the highlight reel pulling every ghost you ever made we're trying stable and we have tgx axe resolute Trade Toad, and we have a Mech Time Blast. All right, nothing there. I think we did the pack trick right that time. Just three from the back on core, which makes it nice and simple. I don't have to do anything too crazy. Human Wins, we have the Performer Pal Drummerilla, Ignite Squire, Hat Tricker, Camilla. We have Aroma Jar, Performage Silver Claw, Performer Pal, I should say. Doggeran, the Bad Flame Kaiju, the Dino one, and the Mystery Shell Dragon, 2K Attacker. Good stuff, good stuff, but is it good enough? It is not. What we want is the best card in the set, tour guide, or probably not the best card, but a really cool ghost rare. Let's go, six style. 
Six style. We have Meteorite. Sounds like Naruto or something. We have uh, Mechlord. Scrap Kong. TGX1 HL. What a very easy card. <laughs> easy name to say. Buster Blaster. Not Buster Blader. Buster Blaster. Reborn Tangu. That's a pretty good card. Okay. Used in older format. So I bet that has a few dollar value. Very solid. I don't think it has a reprint. So that's definitely going to be decent in first edition for sure. Looking good. And here we have our promos, by the way, for our first special edition. We got uh, the token and then the... Oh, not token. It just looks like token. The uh, Zolkin. I guess that's Zol. Yeah, it's got to be a silent T, right? And then engraver of the mark. I don't know. I'm just guessing. But here we go. Core. Last pack of this uh, first special edition. We did have a bonus pack in there, but this is the fourth pack overall. Drumarilla. Ignite Squire. We got Camelump. Ignite Paladin. Ignite Gallant. Raptor's Gust. Ignite Burst. And a secret rare red eyes flare metal. Not the goes with this is a great card. This is actually a pretty expensive secret rare. I think it's like 15 or 20 bucks, like even an unlimited. So it's got some pretty solid value, even though it's the lowest of the three versions. That's not a bad start. EX Gamer, you're getting some good pulls. I want to pull him a ghost rare, an ultimate rare, more secret rares. I mean, any of that would be great. These are not fun pack tricks you got to do some crazy stuff going on some shenanigans elder you know what we could do instead of putting them to the front i can just move those two it'd probably be easier eclord mechlord not eclord and then reboot okay cool stuff we do have more of these so i'm gonna do back to back here i'm gonna try this new version of pack trick so rather than do three and then swap these i'll just go like this is the rare i think so we just go like that let's try that that might be a little bit more complicated actually just because you're holding so many cards red carpet we got to work on our yep that didn't work there's a rare there okay uh watch the ghost here be in the middle of the pack scrap gone yeah i don't that one went awry for sure i don't know if that's the the play we might be pack tricking the entire video and everybody who hates the pack trick will be like no nah, stop it make it stop we have singing lanius we have the bubble barrier rooks and special wavering eyes tam tam Despot 005, the damage juggler. We have the ferret, fla ferret flames, okay. Ignite champion, and uh, we got a Zhangxing magician. Not bad at all, it's another super. We'll take it. Extreme Vic, let's go. Gotta believe, let's... Yeah, that. I, yeah, I definitely didn't grab the right card. I just skipped the rare, that's what I did last time when I did the... Yeah, because they're next to each other. Clock Resonator, Runaway, Karakuri. ESP, we got Hush Psychic. And an ultimate rare, Blackwing. Kagaroshi, Kagarashi, the Wanderer. I have no idea about this value. This is not a card I have seen very often. Ultimate Rare Blackwing, Kagarashi, the Wanderer. Very nice card, but is it very nice value? You guys will see. Pretty cool card though, we'll take it. And that does not necessarily ruin our hopes for Tour Guide or a Ghost Rare because that is an Ultimate Rare, so that's okay. We're not like fretting that that wasn't the card we wanted. Aroma Guardian, not yet at least. Balance of Judgment, we have Ferret Flames. Four Magic Day Damage Juggler. We have the Dej. I don't know what I'm saying. Toon Cyber Dragon used to be money. I, don't, I think it's about 75 cents now. DD Pandora. Okay. Little uh, little music playing in 2011. Nice. Extreme Victory. Come on, baby. We've got an Ultra. We've got a couple Supers. We've got an Ultimate. I mean, it's been pretty good overall. Let's see if we can turn it around even farther, you know, to the best. The absolute best stuff. We're kind of like making a half turn. Let's get that complete turnaround. TG Warwolf, a Resonator Call, and we have the Morphtronic Stapling. Watch out for that stapler coming for you. Oh, there's our more promos. I got a little carried away there. Okay. Sand, no, Destruction Sword Flash we didn't get last time. Okay. Let's try to open the promos. It's like, okay, this is kind of weird. Here we go. We have Ignite Margrave, Balance of Judgment, Mystery Shell Dragon, Retaliating Sea, Perform Age Hat Tricker, Camelump, Aroma Jar. Aromage Bergamot and an Aroma Garden. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. <sighs> Extreme Victory, baby. Let's go. Come on, we gotta believe. We gotta believe Extreme Victory. You can do this. You can pull something crazy. We have Mental Seeker, Power Up Adapter, Mechlord Army of Wazelle, TG, Clock Resonator, Psychic Reactor, Self Mummification, Psy Beast, and we have a, a Serene Psychic Witch. Not bad, not bad. Let's do back to back because we are still a little bit ahead because we had eight extra packs there. One, two, three. Let's get that Ghost Rare right here, right now. You gotta believe. Ceiling Ceremony. Force Resonator. Red Dragon Base. Serene Psychic Witch. Reboot. Psychic Reactor. We have TG Warwolf. Brain Hazard and the Mech Lord Army of Skiev. One more and then we'll go back to Clash of rebellion gotta believe guys ex gamer i feel your luck right now it's becoming powerful will we get remember when we got that ancient fairy dragon uh catapult we have scarlet jar turtle fortissimo tg rush rhino and it's a secret rare gladiator taming and it is also missing part of the g up there as you can see 
Very interesting. I don't remember this card at all. Like, honestly, if you asked me if this was a card and showed me the artwork, maybe if you even showed me that, like, like a fake artwork of it, I'd be like, mm, I don't know about that. And by fake artwork, I mean like a fake version of the card. I'd have been like, mm, I don't think that's a real card. And then guess what it is? One, two, three. But it's a secret, so we'll take it. It is not the tour guide, though, which sucks. Aroma Garden, we have the Mystery Shell Dragon, Human Winds. Raid Raptor, Brilliant Spark, we have Rank of Magic. Super Every Samurai, Crystal Rose, and the Perform Mage Trick Clown. That's okay, though. We don't need the tour guide today. Our goal is to pull the missing Yu-Gi-Oh cards, and we're not missing the tour guide. We have pulled that before. My very first box of this actually pulled it, but what we are missing is the Ghost Rare. It will not be my card, but we're, I don't have to pull it for me. You know, I just have to pull it in general, but for my binder, I do need one. Uh, I don't actually know if I need this specific card, but I do need to get a near mint version at some point. TG Warner Magician. Oh. That was kind of crazy. <laughs> it just landed on its side. Okay, uh, looks like, uh, yeah, everything looks okay. All right, sorry, EX Gamer. Didn't mean to drop your card. TG Wonder Magician. It scared me a little bit with being the synchro. And then now I can't even, I don't even think Junk Berserker is a synchro, so it doesn't even matter. So yeah, that it wouldn't have mattered. Synchro is just, you think they're ghosts. You're like, even if there's no chance of a synchro ghost, you're like, oh my goodness, it's here it comes. All right, this one will be a non-synchro, but it will be the Junk Berserker Ghost Rare. Lantron, Scrap Kong, Boon. Asper Girl, we have the Lancer Linworm, we have the Soundproofed, and Sheehan's Advisor. It's another hollow though, it's not bad. Good stuff so far, we do have a lot of packs left still, so there's a lot of potential here. I've not pulled a missing Yu-Gi-Oh card yet, but I believe that we can do it at some point. We have Perform Age, Trick Clown, Pianissimo, Didi Pandora, Ignition Phoenix, Keeper of the Shrine, we have a Raptor's Gust, Perform Mage, Stilts Launcher, Magical Abductor and Wandering or Wavering Eyes. Wind, wandering and Wavering, they're not quite the same. They are a little similar. Man, I really can't hold on to anything today. I'm trying to be like too gentle with it. And then, you know, you just throw it all over the place by doing that. All right, let's 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 focus in. No more dropping stuff, especially when it's a Ghost Rare. One, two, three. Here we go. I want to be very careful with these cards, which maybe is why I'm being so gentle. Lantron, Rux and Special. We got a Meteorite. Contract, I remember that Meteorite being, had some crazy implication. Might've been a Master Duel. Uh, we have the Reshipro Dragonfly. I remember pulling this Dragonfly like three times in auction series. And Boon and the Mech Lord Empara. Empara. Strikes from victory again. Come on, baby. Gonna be a longer video, guys. I mean, we're gonna we're gonna probably break the 20 minute mark, which I consider a longer video. 30 is a long video. Like if it's a 30 minute video, that's just straight up long. 20 plus is longer. You know, normally we go for like 15 ish, I would say, and sometimes it goes longer. Hush, Psychic Cleric, sometimes shorter even. Red carpet, which I don't usually like to do videos that short, but sometimes it happens. More promos. We've gotten that one every time, and then an engraver of the mask that time. A lot of foils in this opening. I mean, some are promos, but there are a lot of foils out here. Aroma Jar. That's a card. That is a card. What do we got next? Speaking of aroma, we got the garden. Mystery Shell Dragon. There's another human winds. Oh, that's the same aroma jar, isn't it? We have the samurai. Raptor's Force, Silver Claw, we have the Comongius, and a Form Age Trick Clown. The victory of extremeness. Here we go. Let's do this. One, two, three. Gotta believe, baby. We have Contract with the Aquamere, Elder of the Six Samurai, TGX1 HL, Unknown Synchron, Scarlet Security, Axe Dragon Ute, TG Jet Falcon, Soundproofed, and we have a Mech Time Blast. Okay, nothing there. I'm still looking for that missing card, guys. Are we gonna be able to pull something in this video? Missing Yu-Gi-Oh card. We need one. Secret Blast. I take both, though. That'd be crazy. EX Gamer would be very happy. We have Extinction on Schedule. Stilts. Silver Claw. We have Fair Flames. Damage Juggler. Dragong, and we have the Ignite Squire. A lot of Ignites in here. I feel like I don't hear a lot about Ignites, the archetype. Is that like still an archetype people play? Let me know in the comments. Okay, I'm probably just like offended somebody who's like a huge Ignite player. It's like their, their number one deck. They identify by the Ignite deck, and I just said, oh, nobody plays it anymore. And they're like, yes, it, somebody plays it. Okay, Ignite is cool, all right? Take it back. Reboot. We have the localized tor tornado. Okay, we have full house, and out of the blue. Out of the blue, I insulted Ignite. Sorry about that. We're getting down. We're getting down to the nitty gritty, guys. We're getting down there. Mystery Shell Dragon, Trick Box, Flame Eater, Salute Tiger, Camelump, Ignite Paladin. Oh, careful. We have the Gallant. I almost pulled all the cards. Uh, the Dog Rand, Good Flame Kaiju, and a Zang Zangi Magician. I feel like this is a decent card as well. We got the Zhangxing Magician, and then the 
Zanki. I don't know how to say that one, but we got them both. Still probably at least 10 packs left. Uh, we had 40, so we're about probably three quarters of the way through the opening. It's been a good one so far, I would say. Been very solid, but has it been incredible? Not quite yet. But if we end it on an incredible note, it could be. Runaway. Catapult. Tyrant's Tantrum. Force Resonator. We have Brain Hazard. And the Debunk. Super rare. Another super. So we've gotten a secret and an ultimate. So it's it's really just hoping for that ghost at this point. All right. We got six packs left here and then four left of Clash. So let's go ahead and open this. Let's knock it down to five on this side. We have the TG1 EM1. Ruxton Special. Force Resonator. Fortissimo. Tyrant's Tantrum. Out of the blue. Scrap Kong. W Nebula Meteorites, Junk Servant, that's a couple bucks, I think. And the boon of the Mech Lord Emperor at it again. Let's just even it out here. Open the Extreme Victory, and then we'll have four of each left. Eight total packs for about 80% of the way through at that point. 20% left. It can 20% could be the best part though. Amplifier with that the Gladiator Beast Tigerus. Tigerius, actually, is what it said. Tigerius is probably how you'd pronounce it. Tantrum. Clock Resonator. We got Kari Curry. Jet Falcon, we got TG Striker, and we have the Morphtronic Staple Man. Staple Man's back at it again. All right, those are our last promos right there. Last pack of the second to last special edition here. We did get a cover card so far, which is nice. There's a bent common right there, probably because a lot of the commons are like sticking up in the core packs for some reason. Trick Clown, Birds of Paradise Lost, Drummerilla, Stilts, Ignite Gallant, Ignite Paladin, Camelump, we have a Cosmo Town and a Perform Age Flame. It looks like the dude, the Chain Chomp. He just looks like a Chain Chomp with a hat on. All right, I'm gonna move this box out of the way so we can really visualize what we have left. Seven total packs. Oh wait, there are more. There are more promos here. I guess I, there's some at the end. Let's just get those out of the way. Fourth to last Extreme Victory, seventh overall. One, two, three. Bless us with something crazy. We have Ceiling Ceremony, Jet Falcon, Contract, Staplin, Esperger. I can't pull the card. Lancer Linworm, pretty weird card to be such a new card. Uh, Salvage Warrior and the Resonant Destruction. Okay, okay. Need some luck, guys. Send the luck in the comments. Help us get that missing Yu-Gi-Oh card and achieve our goal, or continue to achieve our goal of all the Ghost Rares. Black Metal Dragon, Wavering Eyes. We have the Silver Claw, Ferret Flames, Damage Juggler, Samurai, Esker, the Frost Vassal, and a Brilliant Fusion Super. This is a broken card. I think it's banned to this day. So, pretty broken card. Core was a pretty good set when it comes to playability, I think. Five packs left, everybody. Five packs left. Come on, Extreme Victory. Last second epicness. Here it comes. Last second epicness. We have the TGEM1. Mental Seeker. Seeking the Mental. Tigarius. Scrap Kong. TG. Clock Resonator. Lantron, Salvage Warrior, and a Psychic Reactor. Only two more Clash of Rebellion. I've never had a great, well, that's not true. I've had good luck with Core. I just have never pulled the Ghost, which we already know. But we've had some error packs, so it's been pretty decent. We have Squire, we have Singing Lanius, Bubble Barrier, Ignite Paladin, Fuzzy Lanius, Brilliant Spark, Rega Magic Raptors Force, the Kamungius, the Sticky String Kaiju, and, ooh, an Ultra Aromage Rosemary. Ultra rare is not bad at all. Very solid. Okay, we hadn't really seen a foil out of uh, core in a while, so that's good. Second to last extreme victory. We're getting down to the very end. One, two, three. Do a little flippity flip. Let's get that ghost rare right there. Aurora Paragon. Elder. TGX1 HL. TGX300. We have the Axe Dragon in Mech Time Blast. Mech Lord Factory. We have Chaos Infinity and the TG Catapult Dragoon. Okay, all comes down to this, guys. We could pull the two cards we need right now. All it takes is one pack each. Core, let's go. They look, another common. See, what is up with these? Something with these core packs where they just don't stay like in the same order. And that card's bent now because of that. That's unfortunate to see old Konami. We have Secret Blast. 2015, we have the return. That is a Ruxin special. Fuzzy Lanius. Melodious Diva Tam Tam. We have Hat Track. We have the Despot. DDD Marksman King Tell. And the Raid Raptor Singing Lanius. That Ghost Rare Red Eyes Flare Metal. One day I will find you. Okay, final pack, Extreme Victory. Ghost Rare right here. All it takes is one pack. If you guys have enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more epic content like this. Make sure to thank EX Gamer for providing content for me on the channel and for you guys to watch. He's a legend. Let's go. Six style. Six style. Do real. We have a red carpet. Unknown Synchron. Let's go. Elder. Blackwing. Jin. The Rain Shadow. And finally. 
Lancer Dragonoot. Ended it on a super, so it's not terrible. We did get a super rare. Lancer Dragonoot. I do like the look of this guy. He's pretty cool. Shout out to Toe and Fo Show, Daxter, JT Cho, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, America Doidster, Supreme Sage 21, CJ, Leo Gwine 62, Another Tai Show, Ian Musa, Junior Barney, Mimic Gecko, and Robert F. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.